Hi, and today we're talking about what goes around comes around. We could also say it the way Jesus did in Matthew chapter 7, verse 2, where the Lord says, For with what judgment ye judge, ye shall be judged. And with what measure ye meet, it shall be measured to you again. In these verses, the Lord is talking about destroying the wicked, but he's specifically talking about those who rule in oppression as tyrants, those who destroy other people, those who trample upon others' rights or property or privileges, um, those who, um, as I said, are, are the true tyrants of the earth. Anyone from a great military leader to a bully on the sandbox falls under this same condemnation and it could be a corporation, it could be a government, it could be any and all of these, but someday, even though in the eyes of the world, hey, they must be doing everything right because it looks like they're very successful, it may not be that way in God's eyes. And so let's see what Nephi and Isaiah have to say. This is Second Nephi chapter 24, quoting Isaiah chapter 14, starting in verse 5. The Lord hath broken the staff of the wicked, the scepters of the rulers. He who smote the people in wrath with a continual stroke, he that ruled the nations in anger, is persecuted. The whole earth is at rest and is quiet. They break forth into singing. Hell from beneath is moved for thee to meet thee at thy coming. All they shall speak and say unto thee, Art thou become weak as we are? Art thou become like unto us? For thou hast said in thy heart, I will ascend into heaven, I will exalt my throne above the stars of God, I will sit upon the mount of the congregation in the sides of the north, I will ascend above the heights of the clouds, I will be like the Most High. Yet thou shalt be brought down to hell, to the sides of the pit. For I will rise up against them, saith the Lord of hosts, and cut off from Babylon the name and remnant and son and nephew, saith the Lord. The Lord of hosts hath sworn, saying, Surely as I have thought, so shall it come to pass, and as I have purposed, so shall it stand. The Lord's promises are certain. He cannot and will not lie, and we can trust every word that he says. Until next time, happy reading.